Welcome back everybody to another Friday where we're talking about just the different anxieties that come up in our life and the different things and how we can navigate through them. Today I want to talk a little bit about resiliency. Resiliency is one of those words that we hear about and yet we're not always confident in talking about because we're not sure exactly how to apply it to our life. And really when we're we're looking at resiliency, we're looking at how we came through a really difficult situation. Maybe we feel beat down or we experienced some sort of failure or, or dip in the road that, that, that we didn't know was going to happen. And what we can do when we're resilient is we can choose to be optimistic and then move towards solving a problem. Oftentimes when we get stuck, we have a lot of anxiety. Being stuck is a very hard place to be. It's, it's emotionally and mentally draining. It takes all our energy from us and we can easily become exhausted and worn down. Oftentimes when that happens, we're more prone to having more conflicts and more problems because we're not at a place where we're able to even rely on our reserves because we are so exhausted from whatever the conflict or the problem is that we need to solve. Through the pandemic, this has been something that collectively we've experienced because there was this problem and, and there are all these different ways of being able to solve the problem. And everybody has a different way of going about and solving that. And that in and of itself can cause a lot of anxiety. The resiliency part of it is when it comes into play is when we choose to solve the problem in a specific way for ourselves. And then we choose to be optimistic about solving that problem, meaning we're able to see this as a good thing and we're able to, to con not even convince ourselves, but tell ourselves that, that we're going to be able to make it through, that whatever this is that we've been in is not going to be forever, that we're going to be able to get back up. We are going to be able to move forward and we're actually going to be better and stronger as a result of it. So don't allow anxiety to keep you stuck in whatever problem that may be lurking around in your life right now. Instead, move towards resiliency, optimistic, optimistic problem solving, where you're able to see what's going on and able to start working your way through. Sometimes we feel stuck and we can't even get to that place where we can see that there's a problem that needs to be solved, but we can't see the solution to the problem. Or maybe we're stuck in that we've attempted many different solutions and yet none of them have worked and, and, and that's where we're stuck. If that's the case, find someone to process with, whether it be your journal or a really good friend that you trust and you're able to move forward and, and talk through that. Sometimes just being able to say it out loud takes away the, the, the power of the problem and allows us to be creative and come up with a solution that before we couldn't think of. Well, I hope you all have a wonderful weekend and I look forward to being with you next week.